the name is given. How do you write the formula? This ion is copper. You can write plus two or you can write two plus. Both of them are fine. But make sure you write it at the top. One mistake students do is that they sometimes write it here. Remember, something else goes here. This is not the chart. This tells me there are two copper atoms or two copper ions. It tells me the number of these things. It does not tell me the charge. So the number here at the top is the charge. So write the charge there. Second, sometimes when writing positive charge, students simply write this. They don't write plus. Remember, charge has to be positive or negative. So if you don't mention it, it makes no sense. Because which one is it, positive or negative? Uh, we are used to writing numbers in math that, okay, if it is two, then that is considered plus two. Although even in math, there are cases where it's not considered plus two, it's considered unsigned. But again, that's not relevant here. The main point is that because it's a charge, it has to be one of the two, either positive or negative. You cannot skip that. So make sure you don't make any of these mistakes. Write the charge at the top and mention the charge, positive or negative. Okay, so chloride will be Cl minus one. Iron three will be iron three, obviously. And oxide is O, but how do I know what's the charge? So go in the periodic table. You will see that oxygen is in group six. So that means if this is zero, this is eight, oxygen is here. It has six electrons in it. Now, of course, it will go to eight, which means it will need two more electrons. So that is minus two or two minus. So that's how you figure it out from the periodic table. Similarly, cobalt four, that's straightforward, cobalt plus four. Phosphite, again, go in the periodic table, phosphorus, it is in group five. So that means it is at group five, it will need three to get to eight and lose five to get to zero. Why would it lose five? Eight is easier, eight is closer. So phosphorus will have the charge minus three. Calcium sulfide, Ca, calcium. In the periodic table, it is at plus two or group two, which means now it will go to zero. It will not go to eight because zero is closer. So it will go here, lose two electrons. So that is plus two. And sulfide, again, that is here at six. So it will go to plus six, oh, sorry, minus two. And lastly, magnesium oxide. Magnesium is again in group two. So it will go to zero plus two. And oxide we have already seen, minus two. And that's how you name all these ions. Now the next thing is, how do you write the formula? So for formula, we have a method that I like to call ratio flip, okay? The method is ratio flip. So how does that work? You simply take the ratio of charge and as the name suggests, you flip it. So Cu and Cl, the ratio is two here, one here, you flip it, you get one, two. So it's gonna be Cu one, Cl, we don't need to write one, so we can skip it. But notice that now I'm writing it at the bottom. I'm telling the logic behind this is that A plus 2 ko cancel karne ke liye, to minus 1 required. So basically, we are saying that this copper ka charge plus 2 and this Cl ka charge minus 1. Tha. But because I have two of it, so total negative charge is negative two. Or total positive charge is positive two. So overall neutral. Okay. Remember atoms are neutral. Just like that, compounds are also neutral. Except the charges cancel each other. Let's take one more example. Uh, iron three oxide, for example. I have iron and oxygen. The ratio is three and two. So flip it, two and three. So I write it. That's the formula. There you go. Now, what if the the numbers are the same? Let's look at this one, for example, calcium and sulfide. Calcium is plus two, sulfide is minus two, but the ratio is one to one because they are the same. They cancel each other out right away. I need one calcium 
एंड वन सल्फाइड टू कैंसिल इच अदर आउट एंड दैट्स इट बिकॉज उनकी रेशो वन टू वन है इट्स नॉट द चार्ज दैट फ्लिप्स इट्स द रेशो हमेशा याद रखना है इस बात एंड दैट इज वाई द फॉर्मूला विल बी सी ए एस यू कंप्लीट दी अदर टू सेंड मी पिक्चर ऑफ वॉट यू राइट नाउ वन मिस्टेक इन दिस इज दैट वेन राइटिंग को बॉल्ट समटाइम्स स्टूडेंट राइट सी ओ लाइक दिस रिमेंबर दैट इज रॉन्ग बिकॉज कैपिटल ओ इज ऑफ ऑक्सीजन सो इफ यूर राइटिंग को बॉल्ट इट शुड बी स्मॉल ओ दिस मीन्स देर इज कार्बन एंड ऑक्सीजन that is very different from cobalt okay so oh, almost everybody sent the correct answer which is co3 p4 and mgo because the ratio cancels out okay so that is all about the formulas now the next question is if i gave you the formula will you be able to write the name how do you reverse this process so again reverse is also easy just like when you have the name you write the ion and then you do ratio flip if you have the formula then you first figure out the ion and then you name the ion that's it so name has ions so you figure out the ions first and then you write the formula just like if you have the formula you figure out the ions and you get back to the name 